morning everybody my name is Eli and welcome or welcome back to my youtube channel so today I have a special video for y'all we're doing another day in the life of med school versus dental school I'm being joined by my friend Shannon she's a first year medical student at the Keck School of Medicine at University of South Southern California wow um, and today we're both gonna be filming a day in our lives so follow along subscribe to the channel if you're new to the channel subscribe to Shannon's channel and let's get into it. Hi you guys, my name is Shay Michelle and I'm a first year medical student at the Keck School of Medicine of USC. For undergrad, I went to Harvard University and just decided to go coast to coast because I had never been to LA, so what's better than going to school in LA? Um, so that's half of the reason I'm here. But other than that, this is an amazing program in general, but also it's warm. Um, but on that note, today is Thursday. I have my laptop here, so I'm just gonna tell you guys my schedule for the day. But Luckily, it's super light, so I'm able to book a few meetings. But from 8 a.m. to noon, I have class. And then at 10, so 10 to noon, I have a required class. But today, it's all about microanatomy. It's 8.17, so I'm a little late to my first class. However, as long as I'm there by 10 o'clock, it is okay. And then I actually scheduled a meeting with a first-year or I guess not first, yeah, first year resident um, it, that is in ob Guy, And so I'm actually meeting her at a cafe later on in the afternoon. So it's a pretty relaxed day, but it will have a ton of studying and then we'll see where the day takes us. Um, on that note, I'm just gonna eat the little breakfast I made for myself and then I will be on my way to class. Hmm, so I actually got a pretty late start to my day today. Um, it's currently 10.45 in the morning. I decided not to go to my 10 a.m. class because uh, for those who have watched my vlogs before, you know that I do not have to actually attend class in person. I could watch it at any time. I happen to have a final tomorrow for dental anatomy, so I decided not to go to my morning class so I could study in the morning. And in the afternoon, I have sim lab, and usually after sim lab, uh, I'm pretty drained, pretty lazy. I don't feel like studying or doing much. So I didn't want to save my studying for after Sim Lab today. I wanted to get a good chunk done in the morning. That way, after Sim Lab, I'm not feeling so much pressure. So right now, I'm actually on my way to Whole Foods to return an Amazon package. And then I'm going to be going back home, getting the rest, getting my stuff, basically, and then heading to school until sim lab so i have sim lab at one o'clock usually i get there around 12 40 12 45 to start uh, getting my stuff set up i'm gonna try to show all of that but i recently found out that we have a practice summative exam today so i don't know how much filming i'll be able to do in sim lab but i'm gonna try my best to get whatever i can filmed or at least get some clips to include in the vlog so in the case of the inner lining, the epithelial layer here, is a stratified squamous epithelium. And when you think about where else do you have a stratified squamous epithelium, on your uh, epidermis, for example, and you think about that as being largely just protection. And the other uh, histologic lookalike for the esophagus is the vagina also has a stratified squamous all right so we are currently leaving for school as i was saying before i'm going to the library i'm going to the library i'm going to study for my exam tomorrow we got a, a practice summative in our sim lab today at one o'clock and then after that i'm probably just going to be doing more studying or some random stuff and that's gonna be my day to day. So I'll catch up with y'all when I get to the library.
Okay, so we just got out of lecture. I'm drinking my coffee and I'm on my way to the actual med school building where we're going to, ha where we're going to have our small group discussions. You guys gotta be on the vlog. Get a free cookie. This is Daria. <gasps> this is Kat. We got free cookies. Yeah. Good. <laughs> gang, soda gang. Ooh, Celsius, sponsor him. Sponsor. <laughs> sponsorship. Dead. Sponsor Emily because sponsor that's the reason I be <laughs> drinking <laughs> Celsius. Drink Celsius every day. Can you not do that? I literally found out that people who drink Celsius on a daily get liver damage. So just girl, don't my liver can regenerate by the time Why I'm Why would you 10. say that while I'm drinking the Celsius? Because. <laughs> That's crazy. Bye. That's Emily and Alyssa. Two out of two out of six, two out of seven. Part of the Keek squad. Matter of fact. Oh, I don't have the picture. I have a different picture. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Here we go. It's like our little squad. Not all dental students, but it's late though. We be going out, having fun. Maybe one day I'll take y'all out with us. actually on cloud nine right now because I found a parking spot downtown but currently I'm about to meet with the first year resident that I was mentioning earlier but um, class is over for the day it's 2 20 and again I had my four hours of class earlier this morning and then I um, just hung around I actually had another meeting with a transplant surgeon so hopefully all goes well with that it was a really good productive meeting about future opportunities but you know I like to wait until things are solidified to say anything but yeah, on that note, I'm about to meet with this first year resident. And so the reason that I'm meeting with her is because I reached out to her um, just because I wanted to know how residency is going, how's the transition been between medical school and, you know, being a doctor now. And so, you know, how she chose her specialty and little questions like that. But um, what advice I would have for any medical student is just if you have any just any sense of interest even if you're not that interested i would say just reach out to residents especially first year residents because those are the physicians that can just relate the most to you because they only graduated just months before um so that's what i'm on my way to do and then on that note i will tell you guys how that goes later all right just got out of sim lab it is 2 38 so that's a pretty quick sim lab session because we start at one o'clock um so essentially today we had a practice summative exam our summative exams are basically like a practical in sim lab it's testing it's testing you on um how you've been able to develop your hand skills over the year and basically testing you on a certain procedure so the procedure that we were tested on today in sim lab was uh, an anterior composite um, which is basically a cavity filling on a front tooth um, and yeah uh, I didn't film in sim lab because it was a mock exam so it was you know it stimulated a real exam simulated a real exam um, but yeah uh, I did take pictures of my prep and my finished um, product which I'll post here somewhere 
Um, I did lose three points for my prep for not having an incisal be bevel for the people that know what that means. Um, and then on my final restoration, I had a little bit of gingival flash. I really need to pay attention to that when I go back to practice before I real summative. Um, and the anatomy on my marginal ridge could have been a little better as well. So two things to pay attention to when I go back to practice before I real summative. Um, overall, I'm pretty happy with my work. I remember, you know, when we just started and I was scared to show my preps and all that stuff. So, I mean, you know, improve, all improvement is great. I do feel a lot more comfortable in sim lab now, um, a lot more competent. And yeah, so it's only 2.39 and I really was expecting to be in there till like 3.30. So I have an extra hour to study. Um, I am gonna go home and take care of a few personal things before I start studying since I have the extra time. Uh, I was going to walk home, but I think it's worth checking when the bus comes because I've walked here and it's a little chilly. So bus comes in 13 minutes, so I'm just going to go hang out at the med school till then. Um, and I'll catch up with y'all when I'm, you know, back to doing school stuff or when I get home or whatever. All right, y'all. So I'm still studying for dental anatomy. It is 6.07. I got my dinner in the oven. I really wanted some uh, pizza. Pizza is like one of my favorite foods. So I ran to the store and got California Pizza Kitchen. It's bomb. Obviously, it's not the exact same as the one you would get in LA. But, or I mean, there's California Pizza Kitchens everywhere. But, um, you know, it's from the store in the box in the freezer section at Target. So, Heating it up now, should be done in seven more minutes. So hungry, ready to eat. And then, I don't know. I don't know how much longer I'm gonna be studying for, but we'll see. Okay, so as you can see, I am back in my room. Um, I've been back from the cafe and I still have the coffee that I didn't finish, but basically the resume was absolutely awesome to meet her. Um, and I'm excited, we're gonna stay in contact. But back on topic, um, for the rest of the day, I'm honestly just gonna catch up on the lectures that I'm behind on, but it's okay. Um, and yeah, I'll just probably at the latest try to stop working around nine o'clock and then just do as my heart desires after that. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Um, feel free to subscribe to my YouTube channel or just check it out also if you wanna get more like days in the lives. I do absolutely way too many of those. Um, but yeah, on that note, I'm just gonna finish up my day with a little bit more studying and then yeah, so hopefully I see you all of you guys soon. Well, a couple of here, but if you um, this kind of looks like this. There's just a bunch of All right, y'all, it's super late. I just came from studying. I just wanted to close out the vlog. It's late at night. Got my exam tomorrow. Thank you everyone for watching, for following along day in the life of a med student versus a dental student. Please make sure to follow Shannon on all her social media, which will be in the description. Definitely check out her YouTube channel. She makes dope med school vlogs. And I really enjoyed doing this video. And I'll see you guys in the next one. So thanks for tuning in. Peace.